there, here's an art activity you could do with your child, and it's Q-tip painting. So look around the house and see if you have Q-tips. Any, any kind of Q-tips will work in paint. Now, if you don't have paint and you have food coloring that you use in the kitchen, that will work too. You can use, you know, the little bottles of food coloring, just pour it in a, you know, little bowl. And also, if you do use food coloring to make it last longer, you can put some water in the food coloring as well. So it just makes more of it. But I'm going to use paint and Q-tips and, oh, and the paper. I have printer paper here. You can use construction paper. You can use whatever kind of paper you have floating around the house. You can leave it square like this. You could cut it, cut a shape out of it if you want. But um, square like this is just great because then it really lets their imagination flow. So any colors, and then you can use one side and then the other side and just paint however they want. And they, you know, of course they could even draw things as well. You know, you could draw a little flower if they want. You know, whatever they come up with is great. Um, so that's it. That's, that's all it is. Just paint Q-tips and paper or food coloring, whatever you have. And I hope you enjoy this idea with your child.